Alright. Okay, okay, okay. Let me go ahead and spam my link, if y'all don't mind. Announcements at everyone. Control V. Yes, please. Send that. Um. Spam that there. Hello, Sipo Gamer. How is it going? Welcome to the stream. Sorry, I'm just spamming my link everywhere. Now on to Reddit, because why not? Ugh. Okay. And then I believe that that is all and that I can start. Hello one words, how's it going? One, two, one words, two letters. How's it going? How's the music level today? Is it a little loud? Oh jeez, it's already started, okay. No, in fact, that music is a little loud. There we go. That's better. I am doing fantastic. Thank you for asking. Um, I'm just trying to get my FPS to even out a little bit because it's a little bit laggy. And it's yeah, it's not even FPS at all. Video settings. Um. Yeah, what the heck, my FPS are not staying level at all. Um... I'm not sure, here, let me, uh... I don't, if it, I don't know why it wouldn't just, or why it would just suddenly stop working. Hey, what's up, BJT? How's it going? Welcome to the stream. Let's hit five likes, guys. That's the goal, is five likes. Um, Cloudbot? Why you no work? I don't... I don't understand. Okay, I just added it back in. Um... Well, what do you mean? It looks like it's working on the website. 
I don't know what you mean by that, apparently. Um... I don't... I don't know. Uh, it should be working. Oh, there we go. Um, then... Apparently I have 72 points somehow. Alrighty. Hi guys. Oh yeah. Um, what should I do this round? Or this stream? Um, tell you what, I want to get more villagers. I also want to join that heist. I have 72 points, what I said. There you go. I'll give you a little bit of extra. I'll give you a little hand. I need more villagers, um, but I have to wait for night time to do that. So, until then, I guess that I shall start thinking about my storage, or my storage, I guess. <laughs> Ahoy. Uh, exclamation point help. And then you can get a list of commands and how to use them. Let's see, where should I put my storage system? And I guess I could always put it over, over here. But then I'll have to deal with that. Which, I, I don't know, I guess I'm planning on taking that down anyway. Um, What do you guys think? Or I could always just build it over here and kind of dig down a little bit. That's what I did with my previous villagers. I just kind of put like a little punch into the mountain right here. Oh, ouch, I lost. I died. Ouch. Well, that sucks. Because we're already at five? Oh my god. You haven't even streamed for ten minutes, guys. You guys are nuts. Maybe for ten, then? Maybe shoot for ten. That might give you guys a little bit of a challenge. Ow, I hit the lantern. Um, my torches are in this one. I'm gonna light up a cave so that I have more spawns up on the surface. So my yeah, let's leave like 2.0. Look at that one hit. Get freaking wrecked. Also, hello everybody. Hello, hello, hello. How's it going? YouTube is telling me we have eight people watching, which is nuts. So hello everybody, welcome to the live stream. If you're new here, my name is Razorblade195, or it's not even 195 anymore, it's just Razorblade now. Um, it's good to meet you. You know, I hope you're enjoying your stay on the channel thus far. And if you are, you know, I'm trying to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. So you know how to help me out with that. And if you know, if you want, you can turn on subs. You can turn on notifications. Oh my gosh. Uh, and then, you know, leave a like as well. I'd appreciate all of it. 
Oh, one hit. I like this sword a lot. I'm so happy that I made this sword. Now skeletons are just... The only hard part is getting up to them. However, I did lose a little bit of damage against uh, everything else. That's why I still have this other sword on me. It's for like Enderman and stuff. Or like if I want to kill like a sheep or something, I'll use sharpness. I don't. Oh, I do. Okay, I was like, I don't even have everything I need. Then I realized I do. Is that a zombie villager way over there? Let's. Oh shoot! I am lagging. I honestly probably should have died there. Or at least taking damage. Bunch of skeletons, a creeper, a spider. More skeletons. Oh, where, why, where are the zombies at? I swear when I'm not looking for a zombie villager, they're everywhere. But the moment I start looking for one, they just vanish overnight. Literally. Those are kind of busted, um, or at least they don't show properly. I'm, I'm trying to work that out. It's supposed to play a sound effect of a creeper hissing. Ow. Oh, hi, dude. Hi. This is my cat, everybody. Here. This is, this is Milo. He's my cat. He's my kitty. Alright. Alright. Alright, where's the zombie? Alright, let's get you. What do you want, dude? I, I've never understood that either, but I know it's... I guess it's not my game to design. Uh, maybe it does make sense and I just don't get it. It could be one of those things, you know? Oh my gosh. Ow! One sec. He's biting my feet.
Sorry. I am back and shall continue my search for a zombie villager. So we have one firework left. I will save it for if I really need it. And I guess I have like a whole creeper farm though. I literally built a creeper farm for gunpowder. So I didn't have to worry about arrows or fireworks. It's probably not being very efficient right now because it's nighttime. Oh, okay, I do have a helmet. So if I get one, I can give it a helmet at least. That was fast. The fire... What? Why'd you blow up so fast? Also, that was a massive explosion. Fill in the hole later. Oh. I thought I could do it. Apparently, I thought wrong. Ooh, a skeleton or a spider jockey. Very nice. You don't see very many of those. Hey, what is up, Tweem? Welcome to the stream and thank you so much for the like. See that? I just jumped over that arrow, just going straight over it. Well, I guess I'll go back to planning my, um,. My storage system. I don't know where I want it to be honest. Um, but wherever I choose is more or less going to be its permanent location, so I better like it. Um, yeah, I, I think I'm gonna build it over here, cause I I'm I don't know. As of right now, I'm in this area a lot, so I might as well have my storage system over here, and. What I could do is I could kind of do like a little winding path down at least like eight blocks or something. Um, that way it's, you know, I'm not going to accidentally hit the surface when I'm building. Yeah, I think I'm going to do that. Just like right here, I'm going to start a little, a winding little path. I need a beacon, kinda. Or it would be convenient, but I guess I don't need it. Uh, I guess I won't do a wind, I'll just kinda do like a, a tunnel that goes into a straightaway. And then this, I think, will be where the room opens up into what I want it to be.
And with it being underground, I can expand it as far as I want um, without having to really worry. Torches are temporary, obviously. Um, I'll do like a nice, a nice natural looking entrance into a massive, a uh, pretty big uh, atrium style room. Yeah, I'm gonna get I'm gonna get my beacon. I died in the Minecraft world. Oof. Yeah, piglins are they're brutal. But you did find the Nether Fortress. Oof. That's you. That's you know insult to injury right there. I could have sworn I had like way more iron than that. Okay, well there's a stack of iron blocks plus a beacon. It's not enough though. Um, hey, there's more stuff in here though. Not bad at all. Considering that's probably been in my, you know, in that shulker box for at least a couple weeks now. And there's some coal as well. Oof. Yeah, you never want to celebrate. Um, whenever you're in danger, just stay alert, pretty much. There's some more iron blocks and more coal. So apparently I have a bunch of coal. That honestly is probably enough, but I'm, gonna, I'm just going to keep seeing if there's more. Uh, the good thing about diamond armor is that it's relatively easy to replace. You know, it'll only take about 10 minutes of mining to get more. Yeah, that, that's what I'm building the storage system for. So I am not just, and you know, all my stuff isn't just thrown haphazardly, haphazardly everywhere. I'm just seeing if I have any more iron blocks. So I'm gonna build a beacon. Why do I have so much cod in that one? Oh. Okay. I wasn't ready for that, actually. Not bad. That has... I don't actually know what that is. I lied, I didn't know what that was. I mean, you can just continue to play, you know, just count, you know, count your losses and just continue to play if you should, I guess. There's no reason not to. I mean, I don't see a reason, at least. You know, if you are on hardcore, that means you're not playing hardcore. You know, you might have been challenging yourself to do it, but that doesn't mean you are on a hardcore world. So you can respond if you want. I mean, there's nothing saying you can't. Alright, let's see. Let's just put the beacon up top here. Like right here, under this tree. I'll just get rid of this tree, actually. There we go. And then, right here. I'll just clear that little bit of land out. I have no idea what I'm doing, by the way. I've... I don't freehand beacons normally. Okay, um. Core. I think it's look pretty neat. Until I, you know, fill it in, but. Get a skeleton grinder. 
That's what I did. Well, kind of. I built a skeleton grinder really early on for XP, and then I realized that it, it kind of really sucked for XP, but I just continued using it because it's all I had. And then I built the Enderman farm, and now I don't use the skeleton one at all. I really do hate beacons. Or I, like, I hate setting them up and taking them down. It just takes so long. Plus, I'm not gonna lie, they kinda look ugly. Like, maybe if you could pick what block you used, they would look better. But just having like a massive pile of iron blocks, it, it kinda looks bad. Alright, it's time to set up another little bit of a chest monster, I suppose. Up until I at least get what I'm, you know, what, get where I'm going figured out. A melon bone meal farm? What? Oh, is that using like a composter or something? Otherwise, I have no idea what you're talking about. Yeah, but is that just feeding melons into a composter? Because, you know, melons, once you have a lot of them, you kind of just have a lot of them. Alright, let's set up a chest monster, I suppose. Um, Gotcha. Um, gotcha, gotcha. That's actually pretty smart. Let's see, now I'll have another one. There we go. That should be more than enough. And I guess if not, I can always just come back and get more. I'm not very far away anyway. There we go, that's better. Alright, so I want the roof to be like five or six blocks tall. Actually, I'm gonna do seven, I suppose, because why not? Oh, that's going to be way too big, actually. Um, let's block it off right here. And I will use this again. So I'm just going to keep it all dug out. I will use it for... Uh, one of the wings of the storage, I suppose. I don't need this room to be huge. I just want it to be decently sized. There we go. Oh, it's getting to be nighttime. Nice. I will abandon this project for a few minutes so that I can go see if I can get another zombie. Villager. Well, I'm going to go get a boat so I can actually trap it in the boat. There's a few of them. I just need at least one more villager and then I can use the one I already have and breed them together and then I can use that baby as a second as a secondary villager. So I don't want my mending villager in the farm itself.
I'm using the right sword. I don't know why it isn't one-shotting then. I know why it didn't one-shot the zombie. He's, you know, obviously he was wearing armor. I don't know why I didn't one-shot the skeleton though. I just didn't charge it enough. Jeez. Talk about being surrounded. I did hear a spider, but I don't know where it's at. There it is. Oh, never mind. I saw the red and it's like, oh, there it is. Oh, witch. Lovely. I love fighting witches. Oh, are you kidding me? Get dressed up protection on those uh, leggings and boots. Okay. That's freaking weird. So what's the difference between American English and British English? Besides like one or two sayings or whatever. Ow. I wish the farther you fell, the more damage you did in your crit. That'd be cool. I feel like that's really, that would be really easy to abuse though. Oh, gotcha. Hello, Nick. How's it going? Welcome to the live stream. I should go help my villager out. He is probably having a panic attack. Yeah, you can stay there. I know once you drown, you know, you can swim, but until then you're you're screwed pretty much. Oh my gosh, I missed. Oh well. Tis just another creeper hole to repair. I have enough dirt for it anyway. Let's see, that is a skeleton.
Any others? Oh, he had armor on and he got one shot. Dang, this smite is pretty powerful against undead. almost daytime and I didn't find another one not even just one off in the distance like there normally is really oh well maybe tomorrow There's one where? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? I hear it. Where is it? Where are your arms? Oh, follow me. Hurry up. Get under the tree at least. And are you not going to pick that up at all? Okay, well. Wow, you came in clutch. Last second and you were there. I just can't go anywhere while he's healing or else he'll despawn. So, for a minute, you are stuck with me. So yeah, you, why don't you have arms? Oh my god, that's brutal. Also, you have like a floating hat. God, you look like you had a rough day. Yeah, and I'm gonna be here anyway. Might as well mine. Also, I he probably can't pick stuff up because he doesn't have arms. And he can't put on a hat because he doesn't have arms to do it with. Just in case. I guess I'll just sit here until he heals.
Dude, while I'm waiting for that, I guess I'll expand this entrance a little bit. I got 35 gunpowder last night. That's not bad. Actually, I want to make sure this room is actually nice. Hello, sir. You're going to be a pain to get out of this cave, but I'll figure it out. If I have to use a piston system, I will. But you will be getting out of this cave. Um, anyway. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. It can go one more out in this direction. Let's make it a nice even 13. Maybe not an odd number, but Okay, and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. We can also go one more out in this direction. Dang. Okay. I am going to go get some pistons to get you out of here. Pistons and buttons. I'll get the whole thing set up so I can just sit in the in the boat and go. I do have pistons, right? I think I do somewhere. There they are. I was looking directly at them and I couldn't see them. I was, I'm freaking blind. I don't need this many buttons yet, but I might in the future. So I'm going to craft 64 buttons. Okay, so. Put a button there. There we go. Go over here. Put a button there. Perfect. Oops. button there and then finally button there with this there there we go look at that painless I would need another one though to get out of the water that's going to be a little bit more pain painful, but... I mean, I guess I could always just build a bridge. Like a temporary bridge out of stone. I'm going to do that. I'm going to build just a, a temporary bridge out of stone. That way, just as long as I'm in a straight line, I won't fall off the edge. And into the water. It'd be kind of a slow process, but it'll it'll save me time in the end. Now I need to get you up there. Actually, hold on. I want to get you to breed with him for a second first. That will require some carrots and then access to the beds, I suppose. Which will be pretty easy to achieve. All I have to do is build a small staircase. And then you'll probably honestly go up there on your own. Once you once you get attached to one of those workstations. It's going to look ugly, but it'll, it'll be fine. It'll work out in the end.
There we go. And then I will give you half. And then you the other half. I'm gonna break your boat. If you go the wrong way, I'm gonna get you back in it. Yeah, this might be a lot harder than I thought, and I might have to just bring him up there temporarily. Didn't think so, but I could, I could dream. Mingle with him. Oh. Please be on the side of the glass. Y'all can't reach each other. Then let's put your workstation right there. Right there. You, you can't get out anyway. Oh, you're out of food, aren't you? Come here, back. There. That should give you guys some food. You can't get out this way, dude. Oh, it's bed. It's nighttime. Wait, no, it's not. Oh, it's about to be, though. Well, I'm going to skip this night. Um, here, you can have that bed. Wait, what? I have no idea why he woke up on that side. That's a problem I'll do with him right now. Don't mind me. Nice. You know what? The baby can probably get out of this easily. Not if the parent does not have a workstation. Alright, let's get this set back up. Two accept villagers. 
Okay. I guess I didn't really think about how many the baby up there, but I'll figure that out when I get there, I suppose. Um. Oh, perfect. You stay out here, and you go in there with the kid. Ah. Right, in theory, you're trapped in there now. And then, in theory, you are unemployed. I'm gonna figure out how to get that baby's baby out there, out of there, soon enough. Um, for you, I want to try to get you to accept one of those workstations up here. I don't know how I'm gonna do that. Okay, I'm just gonna get more blocks and I'll build him in, and then he'll have no other choice but to go up the stairs, pretty much. I guess I could do the same thing with the baby, but it can be a pain with the with, you know, with them being only one block tall. There we go, that should be more than enough blocks. I'm just trying to get the baby or the villagers up there. And then once there's four up there, then I will be I'll just open the doors. Now, in theory, the only place you can go, I guess you can just do that, but not anymore. In theory, the only, there you go. Keep going, we're almost there. Easy peasy. And then to lock you in here, but still allow the baby in here, I'll just put a bed there. You're not going to accept a job, you lazy bum. Okay, and then this one. Because it shouldn't be too hard to get him up there, huh? That was really easy, actually. I thought that'd be harder. No. No, ah. Uh. Well, at least the bed's facing the right direction. Can you not? Huh. Okay, that's a thing, apparently. I'll have to find somewhere else to hang those lanterns. Otherwise, it gets pretty dark in here, I think, doesn't it? Um, F3. Um, oh, I guess not. I guess it doesn't. Okay. There. Shawl are now trapped in here. Now, for me to make my escape. There we go. I should have an observation room. 
like a little platform that I can just watch. Also, since I have my boat out, I guess I could take you back over to the base. I do plan on using you uh, often. Um. Get in the boat. Thank you for getting in the boat. I can't lie, it's been pretty painless so far. Something's about to go terribly wrong. Also, yes, that's how ores work. Not even pumping anything. Also, they're kind of just rowing themselves. That's, that is definitely 100% how ores work. Also, there's got to be a faster way of doing this. I guess this isn't like terribly slow, but it's not fast by any means. That also looks like a chicken coop now. I just I just realized <laughs> that definitely looks like a chicken coop. Let's see. Ooh, this would actually be a perfect spot right here. Look at that. Okay, so if I just replace this with this. Actually, if I put it further back, or even just put a bed back there and delete the one that's over there. Like this. Um, let's see. So in theory, if I give him a little bit of room for a bed right here. And then, did, did that kind of thing. That gives him a lot of room back there, actually. Yeah, that should work. Since he's my mending villager, I want him to have room. So I guess, and then I can just, once he gets in there, I'll put that in there. I'll just have to wait until it is nighttime. And, or I guess I could just... Where's this lectern at? Oh, it's in there. Then I guess... I just pray that he doesn't go down there. Because he will die. I just break the boat and pray that he goes the way I want him to. Would you look at that? You are now trapped in there, sir. Oh, let me in, please. Let me in. Let's push my way through then. So a lantern in the way of me jumping. There we go. Now take a step back. Oh wait, hold on. I can still reach it from way back there. Um, I want that to be a f back up there. Then how do I get the pressure? How do I get that facing towards me without just going in there? 
No, uh. So we restart. It's night. No. You will not go out there. You will not go out there. Go to bed. Is your bed not accessible? He can only go that far into his bed. I wonder if the lantern is screwing with it again. Oh, I appreciate that, man. There is definitely a link down in the description. This stupid villager won't do what I want him to do. Oh, I, I see. Well, hey, that's okay, man. You know, I don't ask for him for a reason. What are what do you want that is out there? There is nothing for you outside. You will die out there. The only reason you didn't die out there before is because you were in a glass tube. And that's completely okay. Oh, I thought you went outside for a second. Like, are you kidding me? I'll tell you what, so I don't have to worry about it. You know, so I don't have to worry about him freaking flying outside. If it does, I can just put him in a boat. But if it's nighttime, that's a little bit more of a risky situation. What What is wrong? Why not just go in here? Thank you. And then... Right here as well. Come on. Are you, are you kidding me? Go back to your workstation. What? I thought you couldn't get out of those. She what? Fine, go back to your workstation. Don't do it. Get out of the way. I don't want to hit you because you are the perfect mending villager. Even with, you know, even without your amazing promotion, it still only needs like 10. I don't want to hurt you, so please just move. Oh. Just move, please. I can't get out without you, with you standing right there. Ah, oh, you're kidding me. I just need to get behind him. Then I can still reach him. Oh, come on.
Now you are completely safe. There's nothing that you can even get in there to harm you. Especially if I do this. And I can reach all the way back to that back wall if I need to. So, okay. Bad. You almost tricked me. You almost tricked me. Hello, Julie, uh, Julie Ketro, how you doing? Sorry if I slaughtered your name, I'm so sorry. But hey, how's it going? Welcome to the channel. I'm just patching a couple of creeper holes right now. Um, waiting for my villagers to grow up so I can actually set it up properly. I guess I don't need this anymore, huh? I'm doing fantastic, thanks for asking. Let's delete that little bridge that I had set up. And we should be good to continue our project now. Now that distraction is out of the way entirely. Let's just go back to our project. Um. Okay, so pretty much what I want to do is I want to set up a decent looking storage system. Also, that is not centered. What? Oh. One, two, three, one, two, three, perfect. There we go. That should now be completely, perfectly parallel. Okay, so if I have a wall right here. So it's about two blocks wide on each side. Then I have chests that are, let's say that andesite is a chest. And then, that's, what if I just, I don't, I don't really plan on having my mass storage in this room. So what if I uh, do something like this? Kind of, and then... Oh, it needs to be one block taller right here. Which I can do. Okay, and Zan have like a block right here, chest there, and a block there. And then, then I can use this block to display what's in the chest above, and then this block right here to display what's in the chest below. That make sense? Because this is only gonna be for like my, my small items, like uh, my diamonds, uh, everything but like cobblestone pretty much because I just have so much of that or it could be here too But I'll have to manually put it all in shulker boxes um, Which is fine Let's see I'm just trying to add ex you know uh, expanded storage too. Oh yeah, it's uh, it's called Share the Stream. It is my fastest pickaxe except for, and subscribe. Okay, I'm glad, I'm glad somebody understood what I was trying to say. Um, it, it made sense to me, but I, like I said, I don't know that it made sense to a whole lot of other people. Um, 
So, and then I want to do like a ruined kind of look, like um, kind of like what I have what I have going on in my other cave. How far back is this? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. That is a complete coincidence that I did 13 there. But I will go ahead and do it right here too. So 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Perfect. Uh, one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. There we go. Uh, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's not there if I just dig straight this way. Perfect. Oof. Don't you hate that? You go to say something, but, you know, like, you're... Li I've, I've literally got to the point where I've been opening my mouth to say it and then it just like, you know, it just It's gone just like that Now my plan as of right now is to You know put you know set up all the items that I have already and then Set up the rest of them kind of as I go. Um, see this section. I'm actually going to go grab some signs so I could map out where I'm going to put everything. I know I hate it. You know, especially like I said, when you're literally opening your mouth to talk. And then it just vanishes. The thought is just gone. No longer exists. It's like, you know, it basically got Thanos snapped. Oh, wait, what? That was a... I didn't know you could break a... I didn't know you could break that with your pickaxe anymore. Right. Uh, I didn't know that that was a thing. Anyway. Oh, there's a cave. You know what? That might be good. It might be... It might be where I can route all my redstone and stuff. So I don't have to dig out an area. So I do plan on this whole system being automatic. That looks... That one block took or uh, blew that whole corner out of perspective, pretty much. And then I'm gonna make it more or less look like um, more or less look like I just kind of dug into it on accident. And you can, but it is it takes like a ridiculous amount of redstone and you know redstone knowledge, and I just simply don't possess that capability. Um, you know, obviously if I watched a tutorial, I could figure it out pretty easy, but, you know, I really don't want to watch a tutorial on how to do a stack, you know, a, a system like that. If I need to, I can just, uh, I can manually sort it myself, which I know I'm not good at. Obviously I'm not good at, but I feel like if it's only a few things, it won't be an issue, you know? Okay, there we go. You can't get out. I appreciate the enthusiasm, though. Alright, this whole next little portion is going to be dug with my other pickaxe, so I get a little bit of cobblestone out of this. So I got one, two, three, four. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. I think. One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Okay, 
And then one, two. Um, I guess two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, are you kidding me? I did end up breaking the surface, so I'll have to do a little bit of terraforming here. It's not a lot, though. It shouldn't be too hard. I'll just... Shoot, though. This might actually cause a huge issue. I guess I could just sink the whole thing into the floor, like, five blocks, but... That, oh, that's gonna be such a pain. Um... Anyway, let's dig this whole thing out really quick and then I can figure out what I want to do from there because I do need a couple of blocks out the back so I could do redstone I guess I can still make it work and just kind of terraform a bigger area I could do that um, but I might I'm so bad at terraforming I guess I need a I guess the only way to get better is to practice though so that's what I'll do as I'll just terraform out a few extra blocks and then you know next time I build a storage system that is similar to this I'll just make sure it's farther underground and then if I ever need to expand I'll just expand on to the main wing which is the front facing one Let's go outside and try to terraform over that hole. That only took me like 10 minutes to dig, by the way, that whole thing. Let's see. I'm going to need probably more dirt than that. Um, Just kind of juts out like that. Well, I think it'll look better once it grows in, and then once I add a little bit extra right here. Um, I don't know if I have any dirt though. I have a whole stack right there, nice. So yeah, once I and it's like beef up this little area right here. Once the grass grows, this whole area should just look a little bit nicer. My god, I keep lagging. Do you guys see that? Oh yeah, I think that'll look pretty nice. Now that I have the whole thing kind of built up. Don't check your Discord, that was mine. Who's trying to get a hold of me? Probably this server right here. Yeah, I think that looks really nice. And then... Sorry, someone's uh, live streaming a permadeath to... Or a uh, hardcore on multiplayer. Let's put a couple of dandelions down, just make it blend in. Make it look almost as if it's part of that dandelion patch, just a more spread out version. You know what? I would never even know that there's 
Uh, something under that right now. If you're on this side, you can definitely tell. You won't be able to, though, when I'm done, I suppose. Alright, and then, if my plan works properly... You won't even know that there's chests, or you won't even know what this is, that room is for. Obviously though, it might not work perfectly. Only 54 chests, ooh, that might not be enough. Oh, I need signs so I can actually mark out where everything's going. Um, I don't actually know if I have any wood. So I'll just make a couple of jungle wood, jungle ones, even though jungle wood I don't have a lot of right now. And that should be enough. So pretty much what I'm trying, or I'm gonna do is and something similar to this, but I probably won't incorporate as much wood, because the wood was kind of just to have like a mine shaft look. But I might, I don't know. Okay, so I know definitely that I want all of my stone and wood. Um, and mob drops over there. Straightforward, I'll have my dirt. Um, I'll have my farmables. I'll have my, uh, my valuables. Um, and then, um, hello Adrian, welcome to the live stream, welcome to the channel, and just welcome in general. How's it going? My name's Razorblade, I hope you enjoy your stay on this channel. Right now I'm just plotting out my hardcore storage system. Um, that should work for now. And then, you know what, since I have a mountain right there that I kind of have to worry about with you know space restrictions i'll just go um non stackables uh or slash manually sorted items there we go manually sorted items there we go just so i don't have to worry about you know colliding with this temporary mountain right, that'll work for a second um then i want the chest to start like right here. Then there'll give me plenty of room to decorate the walkway however I choose. Honestly, I'll probably end up going up one um, for the walk walkway. Um, I'll show you what I mean. So my other chests will be about right here. Oh, hold on. I might have. Oh, wait, no, there's gonna be a block underneath. So it'll be like right here. Here, hold on guys. We'll be right back.
<laughs> What's up? Sorry. But I, I unmuted at that time, right? So kind of what I plan on doing, I guess I can do the same thing on the roof. Um, having like a mix, like a random mix between, um, there we go. And then just having the chests. Kind of like this. Or, no. Then having the chests. Kind of like that. And then, um, I guess I can actually do three rows of chests. It might be a little bit hard though, if I'm gonna have it auto sorted to do three rows. I guess the middle row I can just manually sort if I want to. Do a, a middle row. I don't know that I will though. Um, oh dang. Hey, good job on that win, by the way, man. You just like doubled your points. Okay, and then have something similar like to this. And then I guess maybe like I said have another row right here all right sounds good man um Then a third option, or a third chest, way up here, and then I guess I can do another row of cobblestone right there. Hopefully there's not like a thousand villagers over there. I don't really want to massacre villagers. Um. Anyway, and then something. Oh. Well then, that wouldn't work. Um. So I'll tell you, let's go back to what I originally had planned. Except I guess I can shrink the roof down by just one. So I do want another layer of blocks right here. A chest right there. Oh wait, no, I won't even have to. I can just go like this. Oh, I might actually have to, cause wait. Oh, I was doing it wrong. Um. Oh my gosh. Um. Something similar to that. Yeah, uh, go to, you know, go to the help page and then you can search actually everything that you can redeem them on. Oh wait, hold on. I might have just discovered a way of doing it the way it was originally, or I just was attempt or using. So I guess I could go like that kinda. Kinda. Then I can get three chests per row. And then just kind of have a sign in the middle right here that points up and down. Hmm.
Yeah, I'm gonna look up a storage room idea really quick. I forgot I had that. My god. I don't- I- I'm gonna delete that, I think. I don't like that. Just randomly getting blasted in the ears with that. Yeah, I don't know that I like that up too much, actually. I might delete that specific one and keep the rest. Then... Um... You know, I think it might work. Um... Let's see. I don't have any extra signs, huh? Um... I can just... I'll remember what's over there. So I guess what I could do is go like, um, cobble. Oh, that scared me. Oh, man. Um, that's also so freaking loud. Oh, my God. Alert box all the way down. Minus 20. Properties. Okay, yeah, that should, yeah, I'll turn that. Down to minus 34 decibels. And then. Let's see. I guess I'll. I will try personally redeeming that same one. <laughs> oh, you're good. I just wasn't ready for it. I have one point. Um, hold on a second. I need to give myself some points so I can test that. Um, I turn on the wrong one? No, it just is not playing. Um, there it is. There it is. Uh, let's see. Loyalty. Um, razor blade. Edits. Seventy-five. Okay. Now I should have seventy-five points. What do you mean? I I do too. Just. Refresh. Creeper. Oh, it's so man. loud. Hang on one sec. I one sec, guys. So I didn't realize I had my camera on. Um, I'll tell you what. I am going to just figure out how the heck I can turn that down. Um, how to turn down cloud bot notifications.
Yeah, I know that his one isn't working for some reason. Um, I'll tell you what, give me just one moment. I am going to test. I'm going to edit this one. Sound effect. Next. Creeper.mp3. Oh. Oh. Oh! Turn that way the heck down. Okay. Let's see. Um, Good, how are you? Alright. You sure? I am happy to be home and off. I'm like so freaking happy. Tell you what, since I can't find my specific one, I'll just add points to everybody. Um, I'm almost done, don't worry, I'm just trying to figure out this. Frustrating this morning for only one thing. Why? I was trying to tie my shoes and he thought I was playing a game so he kept untying them. <laughs> and he did it like two or three times. And I pushed him away and he'd be like, no. Remember to like and subscribe. I have a book. <laughs> Hi, baby. Hi, baby. What? You're a weirdo. I am not. I love my cat. And he is like all about you. Oh, no, no, he's all about you. Quit me. <laughs> he was biting my toes. That's why he was locked out. Oh. Understood. I'm okay. I love you. I love you too. Oh, I just, I deleted the sound. Don't worry about it. Um, oh, there was a sound that I am trying that I didn't like, so I just deleted it. So there's a place I want to go the next time that you ask me where I want to eat at. Okay. And I've been telling you about it for a while now. I'm just wiping it up. I want to try raising kids. We'll see, okay. Um... God, you guys are spamming that one. Holy. You guys really want that creeper one, don't you? Try the creeper one again. I don't have any points, and I apparently can't give it. Oof, you just lost so many points. I'm refunding all the times you guys tried to hiss. There you go. See? Now you know. I, I just had it set to the wrong f item. Now you guys are going to use that against me. I can just feel it, but it's totally going to be worth it. Hey! Stop it. Stop. Milo, hey! Milo. <laughs> <laughs> 
Oh, geez. I can see that one going bad. Um, and then this other one, I did just set to... Uh, there's no... There's no noise anymore for redeeming it. I didn't like the noise, so I just got rid of it. Um, so in theory now, it should just pop up as a notification in the corner over here. And then there's this one, which hopefully I turned down properly. It's not really. Creeper. Oh, man. Let's see if I can turn that down again, like even more. Okay, and now let's go ahead and give this a quick refresh. How many points do I have, by the way? 160, not bad. I have uh, three more seconds on cooldown. And then this one doesn't redeem anymore, apparently. Um, Maybe it needs... A little bit. Um... Let's see then. This one for sure works now. That's pretty instant, not gonna lie. There, that's... That's better. I'll probably turn it on even more though, to be honest. And then we'll try this one now. There. That works. Now you guys can spam that one to your heart's content. And it won't, you know, it's only five points, which I might actually lower more so it gets, yeah, I'm going to go zero points on that one. Now that one's free and you can just spam it as much as you want. I'm actually probably going to take the, uh, the cooldown on it to zero as well. There we go. Now there you go. Now you can literally spam that one as much as you want. Um, but you guys are gonna have the good ones doing it. Oh, let me refresh this. There. Those should be a little bit more balanced now. Um, this one. I might turn that down just so it seems more realistic. Um, and there's this one, which I'll go ahead and hit as well. I'll hit that one again. I'll hit it three times, just see if it actually fulfills all three of them. Uh, if somebody redeems a point, will you give money? No, no, they're just they're just imaginary internet points. Um, no, I don't actually gain anything except for you know you guys get to interact with the stream directly, um, and you know I'm I'm always looking into improving that more. Um, uh, actually. I just added another one. Um, I'm about to at least. Um, you guys are about to hear all the sounds. That one will work. So it's going to be on uh, 15 uh, I don't even want a command on oh I have to um, redeem um, mod there we go I just added a new one. Let's see if it actually shows up. It does. Oh, I know. If, if, if it gets too abused, I'll change it. Also, I'm going to... Looking at that price now, it looks kind of... 
low. Um, all right, go ahead and refresh that page. Um, there we go. That looks perfect. Um, yeah, that looks perfect. Oh, I'm sure I will. I'm, I'm, you know, if my chat ever does get crazy, I will do my absolute best to keep an eye on the people that were there before. You know, like you, Lala, um, you know, Lethal Makes Kin, Super Gamer, um, you know, all, all you guys. I'll, I'll do my best to keep an eye on, you know, on all of you guys. So, anyway, I'm going to head out. Um, I didn't... I didn't quite see what that last one was that you redeemed, but thanks for redeeming it. Um, I'll hey!